been doing a walk, walk around for about 2022. Red Turner, 10MI, 10MI Plus. Um, wife's going to do some technical stuff. But anyway, the usual stuff we've got on the, on the caravan now, the DO, the DOD. DO35. DO35. Yep. Um, they've got their own brakes. Disc brakes? Yep, for the disc brakes and the e ESC. Stability control. That's actually really good. And some bug wheels. Uh, Toolboxes. Plastic excuse our mess because there's crap everywhere that we only had to spend. We're on the fourth week of our trip, so four weeks. Four weeks, we've only had it for two days. Yeah, a full day before we left. A full day, so we had to pack everything in and just ramshackle, throw it all in there. So we're doing a bit of a mess. And we're at Goralia Station at the moment. So, yeah. Three tanks. How do we read this out? This was, first one was drinking water. Two, three, one, we said. Two. So two's drinking water. Yeah. Drinking and water. then three and one are the other two. Um, yeah, we're 165 and 295. Yep. Usual mud tyres. The batteries are outside, not something we like, but they're outside. I think we missed something actually. Um, so there's two 120 amp hour lithium batteries. That's them. Yep, so we'll just take a step back here. What's under, what's this box out here, Brown? That's your compressor for your brakes. Huh. So, you can let the air off. Lets your air off. Yeah, right. Um, so it locks your brakes on. Actually, it does the other way. Takes your brake, takes your brakes off. Okay. What else we got here? Don't go past. Toilet cassette. Standard. Standard thing. Instant hot water. Instant hot water. So it's a generator box, but it gets used at the moment as a toolbox. A messy toolbox. A messy toolbox. Mm -hmm. Shower, hot and cold water. Yep. We haven't done that with the dog yet. We have washed our feet with it, to be fair. Yeah, so this is the outside stuff TV and all that outside. It is. A bit disorganised yet. Yeah. Toolbox. Um, this broke. This broke on. Just the left hand side. No, it's both sides. Both sides? Yeah. Okay. So I have to re-drill them. So, because these are only rivets and iron. That was uh, Ningaloo yeah. Road? Yeah. All those delegations with you. Um, yeah, and the diesel heater. Which is in an unknown, so it's hanging at the moment. Yeah, but, um, yeah. And inside. Okay, so the inside. So, full queen size bed, two, excuse the mess, uh, wardrobes. Wardrobe space, we're going to change out for shelves. Um, don't really need it. Lots of storage across the top. These are really good down here. Um, I've got okay. one uh, 12 volt. Brad's got two. Yeah, I thought we thought these would be a little bit overkill because there's heaps of them in the van. But they're actually quite handy having them dotted everywhere. Hmm. Um, okay, so two Sirocco fans. I actually think we should them and flip them around, but hmm. yeah, two included as standard. The hatch is fantastic. Um, we've got a Scupper, I always get that wrong. Scupper. Which I haven't actually used yet either. Complete overkill on the lights um, if you look at the ceiling, but you know, it's symmetrical, so. Yeah. Uh, and if you like the, if you like daylight at night time, 
and you'll yeah. get it. <laughs> you will. Uh, so this is fantastic here, this bench we're using heaps. At the moment it's got just shoes and um, speakers uh, and outdoor sort of stuff, stubby holders and stuff, but we need, we need to organise it. But it's actually really good storage there. Love the U-shaped the lounge. Um, didn't think we would, but brilliant. The best thing about this van is the size of the windows. Yes. They are absolutely huge. Um, and that's what we we're looking for when we're looking at vans is, is not the Jayco size windows. Um, so kitchen, not a big fan. I wanted black, a black pack, uh, but we can change that later. This was a um, like a demo model. So you take what you get. Uh, so love it. Coffee machine. We've had that. We were running that now, Jayco, and continue to do so here with a 2000 watt inverter. No problem at all. Mm. Um, we get two cups of coffee each every day and, and no problem. Um, so we do have a Swift 500 series um, oven that has broken. Yeah. The lid is broken. That broke on the corrugations into Goralia. It's, been a little... it's probably quite dirty too. I've tried to give a bit of a clean. Yeah, yeah. so just the rivet I think is broken. So that'll be our warranty job um, when we go home. Got an oven. Never had an oven in our life, which is a baby Q. Um, does the best chicken drumsticks yeah we didn't on it, we didn't think we we didn't think we'd um yeah enjoy that that much did we but it's worked but out we quite did. well yeah there's there's three drawers um and a flip at the bottom so chock a full i'm very happy that i scored um double pantry so two here and and then there's a double cupboard at the bottom so Lots and lots of storage here. Another flip down the bottom. I haven't got anything in that, so I haven't even managed to fill it. Um, coffee nook. So all my coffee stuff. And this is our battery plus system or BM Pro system, which we were a bit unsure about um, running a Victron in the last one, but seems to be doing all right. More storage overhead. Compressor fridge. I think it's 223 litres. Um, on the corrugations at Ningaloo, this came out. Yeah, it actually actually fell out. I had to put had to do a, bodgy. a screw in it uh, to hold it. It managed to stay in a, the corrugations into here, going mm. for worse. So we'll have to get that one fixed or warranty. Um, your inverter's underneath the fridge. Fridge is absolutely brilliant. Mm. I'll show that, you. I'll, yeah. show, I'll show that. For anyone who's interested, that's where all your pumps and your inverter lives down there. Um, yeah, it's a little bit of dust, but anyway. Um, and the other thing that we didn't mention were we've got legs, which yeah. we both we both we were wanting a dinette because we wanted to sit sideways and watch movies like we do. Mm. Um, and this is the best of both worlds, really. Our son came with us, and the three of us sat around here and ate, so it's really good. Uh, have I missed anything, dear? Table, usual table. You know the ones that. Do the moving thing, do the... And it will spin the other way as well. We like it this way, but it spins the other way. Yep. Uh, into the bathroom, not a lot to see. Standard toilet, it's a ceramic toilet, which I've never had before, and I don't know why, but it seems to make a big difference. Linen cupboard's a bit of an issue. It's just a big space. Currently, the coffee machine's being transported in there. We're going to put a shelf in, because, um, well, you'll see in a minute, but we've got the dog with us, and she sleeps. Hmm. I'll show you now. The dog sleeps in the shower. So it's the dog's space every night. She's an old lady. Mm. Um, so her bedding has to go into that linen cupboard. So a shelf would be great. But it works a treat. She's up on a dog bed, so she's not, not cold underneath. Yeah. Not cold. Yep. Um, got a ceramic basin, which I'm really happy with again. Wanted, I'm happy with the white. I'd love a black tap. Um, it's Black pack, yep. Yeah, the black pack. And there's a huge cupboard at the top. One open, two big. And I have got the biggest washing machine. I've seen on my travels, it's a 3.3 kilo washing machine. So I think it uses, I've only ever done a full, like high load uh, mm. on the rapid setting. I think it's something like 24 litres of water, something like that. Um, does a decent job if you don't overload it. So mm. yeah, I think that's it. Um, is there anything else? I don't think I missed anything. Oh, the size, like where? Oh, this is a 20 foot. We didn't say at the start. Yeah, it's this is a 20 foot. foot. Oh, it's got the usual things, you know, like your yeah, aircon cool. and speakers and stuff. Um, the size, we're, we're not big people. So the shower and toilet, you know, we're what, I'm five, seven and a half. What are you? Five, six. 
wife sex. I won't tell your wife's weight because she'll kill me. No. Um, yeah, I'm about 70 kilos and it's spacious enough. But yeah, anyway. Oh, we've managed to live in it for five weeks. So yeah, we've been in this five weeks. Good. And um, I reckon we could do a lap in this for sure. Yeah. Oh, I will. Um, just talk about the BM Pro. We made s some user errors. So this tells you everything you need to know. Tells you what's coming in and what the batteries are, blah, blah, blah. But we made a mistake, didn't we? We were running the inverter and charging some phones and stuff during a day and we had dappled sunlight. But what we didn't realize is that the fridge flips over to 240 as soon as your inver inverter's on. So you, so yeah, so you, you're running an infinite loop and it drags your batteries down as if you don't have enough solar. Something, something to, to be aware of. Um, so what, we turn it off, right? Yeah. And what, it, what else broke? The fridge. Oh, don't... this. We're not, not sure about what's happening here. I've got to do some investigations. So it might be just a loose screw somewhere, but it hasn't fallen out. So there's a positive. But we like the van, don't we? Oh, I love the van. We I'm do. Really, really happy. Yeah. We've had yeah. two Jayco's in the past. And, um, yeah, and got this into Gurali and not a problem. What we didn't talk about was the suspension. It's a 4.4 .4 ton suspension. Yes. Yeah. Alpha, I think, is the brand suspension. Yep. Um, it's a... Now I'm going to get that Four. this from ATM. It's a three and a half ton ATM, yeah. and the van weighs two, four, eight, nine. So it's eleven, uh, just over a thousand kilos of payload. Payload, on which this is van, which yeah. Is, don't know of any other van that does that. So yeah, that's that blew, blew our mind when we saw that. That's why we went for, went for this one. Um, it's the aluminium walls as well. Like I, I wanted frame. aluminium frame. I wanted composite. Well, we both wanted composite, but it we want. We would have had to go through Zone or some other dealer, or El we're looking at Elros at one stage. Um, but the payload, you know, with this is second just, to just second to none. So, and their quality is good. Like, oh, it's a five-year structural. Yeah. Well, I don't know if they covered a five-year structural <laughs> guarantee or warranty on the van, yeah. which, again, if you look, is unusual. I think yeah. Jayco do a five-year. I haven't seen anyone else. And like. We've taken it down, you know, two or uh, three, three tracks, you know, long tracks that are very ordinary. Well, for, this was 40 k's on some of the worst road. Yeah, pretty bad. There. And you lose 30 k's of bad road. Too, yeah, so. doing 50, 60 k's just to sit on top of the um, the corrugations, and it's held together really well. Like yeah, it has minimal, a, minimal damage. Minimal things are broken, so I was, it's a credit to um, to the Red Center Caravans. You know, the, their build quality is good. I think. Um, oh, these. I wanted to touch on these. We've gone from a Jayco to these and absolutely love these blinds. Oh, too late. So there's no clips, there's no, um, like with the Jayco, you've got to do it with two hands. I've got these little clips here and over here, which is just really painful. Whereas these, and they're magnetic. Yeah, really like them. Um, can't, can't think of there's anything else to, to say. Hopefully it helps someone in their endeavour to buy one. See ya. Okay, under the van here, I'm just on the walk around. I thought I'd, I thought I'd get under here just to show the suspension. Um, it's, I like it. It looks well made. Um, I'm, I'm a tradesman and, and I work in the metal industry. And yeah, I think it's well put together. And there's your two tanks. Your the bash plates in the tanks are colour coded with the van, which is a nice touch. Um, all the all the wiring and all the um, the way they've run everything seems to be. Well, it's a bit hard to give you the right view, but yeah, they run well. They're protected well. So your brake lines. Um, Disc brakes, they're a game changer. Um, what else? What else can I see? There's your diesel heater exhaust. And 
grey water tank in your other tank. <laughs> and it's got what? Petters track rider shocks, dual shocks on each independent arm. And all your yeah, all your stuff is tucked up under there. Egg piping. So Anyway, we like it. And on top is looks like it's got an aluminium sheet. So it has a uh, 12 mil marine ply, but instead of having the marine ply sitting on top of your frame, it looks like they've got an aluminium sheet, which I think is quite clever. So it stops any of your wood rotting. From water and stuff so that's a nice it's a nice bonus nice touch yeah, the alpha suspension Justine was talking about not Janine Justine uh, hope, hope you get something out of this there was something I forgot to put in we forgot to put in the video <coughs> the extra things the diesel heater it's a very very cold morning here on the beach and the other thing was I forgot to say about the Wi-Fi we're here on the beach and we're getting some internet through the damn Wi-Fi come standard so that's a bonus <laughs>